Hello guys, I'm Shlok and you're watching Tech Burner. Battery drain is a common issue on Android devices and many people wonder why all of a sudden they get a sudden battery decrease or when they unplug their phone from the charger, they get a battery decrease. So in this video, I'll try to tell you the exact reason why there's a battery drain issue on the modern devices and I will also try to tell you why this is not present on some devices and it is more prominent on some other devices. So without wasting any further time, let's get started with the video. So first of all, let me make one thing very clear before starting the video if you have like a spoiled battery or if you're noticing a battery drain after a software update or installing some software then this video won't be able to help you because your battery drain issue is because of that particular problem and not because of what i'm going to talk about in this video so most phone nowadays have a lithium ion battery and with this battery there's a chemical reaction happening inside the battery and because of that if the reaction completes 100 percent then it starts utilizing some other resources for the chemical reaction so if you were to charge your phone to 100 percent and then have the 100 percent charge charge for more time then there would be corrosion in the battery because it would utilize some other resources for the chemical reaction and that's why we have kind of a configuration so as soon as the battery reaches 100 percent the power input is cut off or is reduced by a huge amount and the and it stops the battery from overcharging so that prevents corrosion in the battery and it stops the battery from spoiling itself so if you were to charge your phone when it's at 100 percent charge when you plug it into the charge it is not actually charging the device and the charge would reduce over a period of time so the battery would go from 100 to 90 or 95 and then go back to 100 and as soon as it touches 100 it would go down back so that's kind of how it works with most modern mobile phones and with older mobile phones this was not the case and you might have noticed that the older smartphones uh, the battery degraded over a period of time and the battery would spoil over like a period of two years or something it was exactly because of this issue and that's why the companies have come up with this kind of procedure to stop the battery from degrading but you might argue with me and say that uh, while you put your phone on charge it says 100 percent at all times when it's plugged into the charger so now to explain that i will tell you three configurations that the companies can use and that are the possible configurations for the battery so the first one is to let the phone charge even if it's at 100 percent and let the battery degrade over a period of time the second one is to cut the charge at 100 percent and let the battery fluctuate from 100 to 90 and back to 100 but the problem with this configuration is that if the user is supposed to be charging their device they would notice that even when the device is plugged into the charger the battery is dropping from 100 to 90 and that's why we have the third configuration and it is a configuration that most of the modern day smartphones use and this is also a reason why you notice sudden battery drops so the third one is that the battery keeps fluctuating from 100 to 90 or 100 to 95 then 100 but the display on the device is set to 100 when the phone is charging so the actual battery gauge that you have on your device is pretty much lying to you and it is showing a wrong charge on your device even when your phone is charging and it is at 100 percent it might be from 100 to 90 it could be 90 percent it could be 91 percent it could be 94 percent or anything like that so before we move on to the next reason why there is a battery drain issue if you're liking this video you can subscribe to this channel because i keep making videos like this so now you guys know that most of the companies use a false battery indicator and they show a wrong status of battery and that is quite an obvious thing to do because if they don't do it the people might think that the charger is faulty or the phone is not charging properly and the other reason why you might notice that sometimes the battery would go down from 60 to 70 in one hour and it would take it like half an hour to go down from 40 to 30 and it's a 10 percent difference for both of them and that goes back to the same thing the battery that most of the modern day smartphones use is a lithium ion battery and it works on a chemical reaction and the reaction is not linear at all times so the graph of a chemical reaction would look something like this so what that means is if you try to map the user of the battery uh, on percentage basis then it would give you wrong results and it might show you that for 10 percent battery it gives you one hour but in real life when you use from zero to hundred it might give a different result so the battery life that you get from 100 percent to zero percent would be same at all the times but the rate of discharging would differ at like every percent so all of the things that are told in this video it's nothing wrong with the battery or the phone it is kind of the configuration that companies have used and they have put a false mask on the battery indicator so that the customers don't feel weird and that's quite obvious and also because it's a chemical reaction it is supposed to be discharging faster at some times and 
uh, slower at some times. This video doesn't mean that you should not charge your phone overnight or uh, should discharge your phone to 0% every time or should charge to 100% every time. There would be no difference in the performance of the battery even if you do one of these things or maybe all of these things at once because the battery has been configured to not degrade over all these things. If you guys found this video informative, press on the thumbs up button and make sure you subscribe to this channel for more content like this. This video's notification shout out goes to I can take it. If you guys also want a notification shout out, comment down below after you have turned your notifications on and I'll give one guy a shout out in the next video.